All right, guys, what we're going to look at here is uh, how to get your game chat from Call of Duty Warzone onto OBS if you have your audio input split like I do. All right, and I think this only works for PC, guys. So are you PlayStation and Xbox, guys? I'm sorry. Get it to work great, but this is what worked for me. So came over here to the audio settings, went down to settings audio and come over here down to voice chat. And then you're gonna have all your little outputs, which I have quite a few, cause I have monitors and headset and everything. There's gonna be this one in here called Real Tech Digital Output. Now it's just something that comes standard with, you know, PCs. If you don't have it, then weird, no? But I had it. So I went ahead and selected this for my audio output channel. And on another note, I don't have any of my audio being pushed through Real Tech Audio at all nothing goes through there everything goes through my logitech headset um as my uh audio input and output um when it comes to the pc so nothing's going to real tech um, i just wanted to add that in there so you don't think that you need to add it to your pc settings um in order to get this to work i don't use real tech listed as an output in anything else other than warzone 2 and obs um for the game chat. Now, what this did was pushed all my game chat audio to Realtek. And then once I was able to do that, it made it a whole lot easier to mess with it in OBS, which is what I use to isolate everything. Now, in order to isolate everything, I downloaded a plugin called Wind Capture Audio Plugin. And I got this from the YouTube channel Gaming Careers. This is usually what I check. Uh, into to see what I can use in my stream and I recommend you do the same if you're out here just trying to stream and have fun Got a lot of good content and this is basically how I started out um, just watching this guy and using his little tips and tricks to help me out so I did that um, and the wind capture plugin I'll put the the link down below in the description so you can download it too which i don't even think you need anymore because i'm pretty sure obs has it like standard with the new um updated obs but i downloaded it I don't, whatever i mean if i didn't need it oh well but there we are all right now let's go back over to obs where we need to be for the rest of this now what i'm going to do is just add an audio source now very simple if you're familiar with obs just hit the little plus sign um hit audio output capture or that's what i used um for this now i know i talked about downloading that wind capture but for some reason it wouldn't pick up real tech on there um but i used the wind capture to isolate everything else but we're going to just add a regular audio output capture for this right here now i already have an existing one saying game chat but we're just going to create a new one for the hell of it so you just hit okay it's going to give you devices and all the stuff that you can choose from and just do the same thing that we did before, which is the real tech digital output. Do that, hit OK, and then it's going to pop up on your audio mixer, which is going to pop up right here. Now, or wherever you have your audio mixer at, usually it's down here or whatever, whatever. It's all personal preference. So you're going to come here into advanced audio properties. Now, once you're in here, you're going to go ahead and go to whatever you named it, game chat, whatever you want to call it whatever and in order to hear it through your headphones because you're not using your headphones as the you know the primary source is you're going to turn on audio monitoring you're going to hit the monitor and output and then once you do that it should open up um, that real tech device to obs so you'll be able to hear it whenever obs is open and you have that checked and pretty much done you should have everything good to go and i mean it worked for me and hopefully it works for you. Now, if it did work for you, awesome. Um, and if it didn't, just kind of keep that to yourself. Um, but yeah, man, if y'all, um, this helped you at all, just like and subscribe and just leave something in the comments telling me if this helped you out or not. And didn't, like I said, keep it to yourself, all right?